Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Leslie Ann and I do all types of videos on my channel, including shopping hauls. Today I have a Sainsbury's one. I've just had an online delivery, just dropped off. So I've just sort of taken stuff out, tried to group it in its sort of like little departments, if you like. Um, but I'll show you, I'll turn the camera around and I'll show you exactly what I've got. Now, everything I have got today is to last us for two weeks just me and my husband but we have got child lots of children and grandchildren so i always like to be prepared and have things to hand um but yeah i think i've done a pretty good shop to last me for two weeks so as i say i'll turn the camera around show you what i've got and then i'll tell you how much i spent start this end um right so sort of some of the fresh fruit, vegetables, salad stuff, that kind of thing. Um, I've got a two kilogram bag here of King Edward's potatoes, some pea shoot and baby leaf salad. If you haven't tried this, it's lovely, really yummy. Uh, this was a substitution. I did order onion potatoes, but they didn't have any. Um, so yeah, they've substituted it with these baby potatoes, so that's fine. Um, a lovely looking cauliflower and a white cabbage behind there. Um, I've got some of the sable grapes. They are just lovely. They taste, they just taste different. They're so, so nice, a bit addictive though. Um, so I'd finish with the veggie type stuff. And then here I've got several bunches of beetroot because I'm doing pickled beetroot ready for Christmas. Um, and then I've got some white onions there. Um, oh, a pack of tomatoes just here. Then here I've got two packs of mince, 500 grams. Um, each of those I will just split in half and that's four meals there for Chris and I. Or I've got family coming in, then I'll just obviously use more. Um, a pack of two smoked gammon steaks, absolutely yummy. Um, two packs of these, the chicken legs. Um, these I buy and I cook up for our dogs because they love them. Um, I've got chicken thighs here. They're for us. And with the thin chicken sizzler breasts I've got here, I'm going to be doing a chicken and bacon lasagna, which if you haven't tried it, it's lovely. Um, a pack of the Be Good To Yourself sausages. Then here I've got two packs of the um, Flora buttery, 500 grams each, and I think they were £1.50, a tub bargain. Um, here I've got two packs of lamb's liver, again for the dogs. Um, some grated Parmesan cheese. Now I did order the shaved like the shavings but this was a substitute but fine um wafer thin ham just there um then here i've got some be good to yourself caesar dressing which is why why i wanted the shaved parma um why i wanted the shaved parmesan cheese but Never mind. It was more economical to buy it pre done. Um, then two of these, the Southern Fried Chicken Breast Fillets. Um, two packs of smoked bacon. And then here I've got two nice looking rump steaks. So I'm just going to sort of kind of keep going. I'm on a bit of a flow now. Um, anyway, here, bread rolls, four large bread rolls. And what we tend to do is sometimes we have like a bit of a fake away night and I will put this chicken burger into these. So it's a little bit like having a KFC kind of thing um, with some fries, that sort of thing. Um, okay, picked up this. This I haven't had this before, but I'm, it looks so lovely and delicious. And it is a walnut loaf. And what does it say? Let's have a look. There you go. Walnut cob. May contain shell, so get re ready to break your teeth, I guess. But yeah, that looks delicious. Um, two lasagna 
toppings, you know, the white sauce ones. Sometimes I make it, sometimes I don't, but flour is a little bit precious still. So yeah, I thought I'd buy it. Um, we had this in the week, uh, Piri Piri, the Maggie's Piri Piri. And um, oh my gosh, it was lovely. So I thought I'd get it again. But when I got it last time, it was only 50p, it was on offer. It was a pound this time, but it's that nice that I was cool with it. Um, some granulated sugar, some light brown sugar there. That is for my pickling of my beetroots. Some balsamic glaze. The, that's the sugar there. Some lasagna sheets, a big bottle of extra virgin olive oil, and three of the 165 gram. Oh, sorry, three of the 165 gram jars there of the Law Coffee, which, as you know, if you've been with me a while, my favourite. Um, this was a substitute and I thought I should have had two half dozen eggs, but I only appeared to have one. Um, I ordered a pack of 10, but they, they uh, emailed to say about substitutions and I'm sure it said six times two. So I'm going to go through my list because I'm sure I've only got one. So, um, two lots of baked beans, four in each pack. They're the same as these ones. Then over here, we've got a pack of 16 toilet rolls. For the fridge, this tropical juice. Um, three of these uh, rolls of kitchen towel. Then finish dishwasher powder. Since I had all the problems with my dishwasher, and um, we got it all sorted and cleaned and all the rest of it, and discovered at the bottom, there was lots of the pods that hadn't melted underneath sort of all the heating bits in the washing machine not good so since then i've been using a powder and this one no problem since At the back here i've got this this is the color bio their own really good really really good um this was the substitution as well what did i order i ordered um, I can't remember which one I ordered, but I didn't order this one, but this was a substitution that I don't mind. Bleach. And then over here, I've got grease, uh, grease proof squidge, but that's fine. Some more antibacterial wipes and over here, some bin liners for the kitchen bins. Um, this is the night lavender, the night lavender room spray. It is divine. A uh, deodorant each. So you've got Chris's there, mine there. And then I thought I'd pick up one of these just to pop inside the fridge door um, so that we could just make up some juice and keep it in the fridge and it's always nice and chilled. So I think that's everything here. I'm pretty sure that's everything there. Okay, so I'm going to pop over this side now. Okay, so I have a pack of romaine lettuce. That is going to be for my Caesar salad. Some carrots, spring onions, mushrooms, two aubergines, cucumber and celery. Then I've got five bottles of malt vinegar because this is the one that I use when I pickle the beetroots. Video coming up on how I do it, so look out for that one. If you'd like to see how I do it, subscribe to my channel, press that notification bell, and you'll know when I've done that upload. Um, some brown sauce, some marmalade. This is marmalade, that looks yummy. Um, five cans of rice pudding now i love rice pudding i love a homemade rice pudding chris doesn't like a rice pudding that has skin on it you know like when you do your own and it it forms that skin i know you can take it off but as soon as he sees it it puts him off 
So sometimes I make it and just say deal with it. <laughs> and other times I'll buy it. These are literally 20p a can and they are so nice. Um, yeah, no waste with these at all. Over the back there, I've got some fat-free Greek yogurt. Then here I got some brie, some cheddar cheese, 900 grams, some balsam cheese, um, the light soft cheese for black pepper, really lovely, some Greek feta cheese for my Caesar salad, this cheese here, the brie, the balsam, um, and the soft cheese we're going to be having with the walnut loaf. Um, milk. Got a four pints of semi-skimmed milk. I've got a pack of the chunky fish fingers, extra large. These are what are going in my other rolls. So, you know, I said we're going to have a KFC type of fake away thing in a burger. Well, this is like my little takeaway version, fake away of like um, fillet of fish from... Uh, McDonald's because I literally just put these into the roll um, but then lay fries on the top and then tartar sauce and it's absolutely delicious. Um, some mini corns and these jacket potatoes are a lifesaver. Just pull them out, two of those in the microwave for Chris and I's about seven minutes, something like that. So, you know, always readily available. Um, over here, I've got some lemon squash, four bottles of bitter lemon. Perfect for my gin. Over here, nearly at the end, guys. Um, a four pack of lemonade, each bottle there is two litres, some dog treats. So I've got sizzlers, the bacon ones, mini log bones, meaty strips, 15 meaty rolls, four log bones, the small ones, and another pack of the bacon sizzlers. Now, Oscar can eat these, Oscar can eat these, Oscar can eat these, Oscar can eat these. Oscar's nearly 17. Um, so he struggles, he cannot any longer eat these. But Alcy and Teddy can eat everything. So they tend to get these, while Oscar tends to get more of these. Um, some dog pouches, now in here, there are how many? 12 at 150 grams, little tray ones, the pate ones, and these are, how many are in this one? Oh, and in here there are, 12 in here i think these are 100 grams of the jelly ones and then we use these nappy sacks here as poo bags um in here we have just got loads of salt in here we've got loads of bags of salt loads of bags of salt in here i think we've got eight of these and this is literally just the cook and season salt um one and a half kilograms each and we've got it for trying to kill the weeds and the grass on the drive. Um, we've tried everything from Roundup to, you know, everything. Uh, it works for a while, but it all comes back. So my latest little bit of research on Google has said, try just putting salt on top of it. And then with your watering can, just, or your hose, just water it down through to the roots so we're gonna give that a go okay all right then let me have a look at the receipt and tell you exactly what i've spent it's a big long receipt <laughs> right so the shopping came to 185 pound 35 which does sound like a lot of money but you break that down over two weeks for everything it's not just sort of like um, food is household stuff, it's dogs and, you know, it's everything in there. So it's not too bad, I don't think at all. Um, but I didn't pay that because I paid £169.35 um, because I had some vouchers come through from Sainsbury's that when I did my, if I did an online shop, 
if I spent over a hundred pounds or if I spent a hundred pounds or more I think I got 15 pounds off and I had a little voucher or another one um, but if you if you buy in store you can pay 40 pounds and get six pounds off um, but I didn't want to go into the store, so yeah, I didn't pay all of that. So consider I did get a bargain, really, um, £169.35. You break that down to everything. It's it's fine. Um, the only other thing I need to do is check out the eggs, because I'm sure my email said I had two half dozens and I haven't got that. Um, so I'll check to see if I've been charged for that. But yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this video if you have and you like a good old shopping haul or food haul then as i say subscribe to my channel and i'll see you all in the next one so take care my lovely see you soon bye